Hello again, it's Miss Elise. So as we talked about last time, it's spring and we know we're having rainy weather and sunny weather, but what else happens in spring? Uh, some animals that lay eggs, lay them in spring. And we know they have a hard shell to try to protect them. But what do birds do? They also build a nest, right? To try to keep the eggs safe. It's something soft all around their egg to protect it. But if the egg fell out of the nest onto the ground, what would happen? It goes flat, right? So today for this experiment, we want to try to protect an egg that's falling um, from high up, like if it were in a tree. For that, you get to use some recyclables. In Discovery Lab, we always recycle our paper and plastic. So you'll need some paper, maybe some old paper you don't need anymore, plastic, a plastic bottle, I have a cup here, maybe you have an old bag that you want to get rid of, something that can hold the egg. Now I think I can protect my egg by wrapping it up in paper. I'm also, I also cut out a piece of the egg carton. I mean, eggs come in egg cartons, so maybe that will help keep it safe. I'm going to wrap it in the paper. I think some napkins are nice and soft to cushion it if it, for when it hits the ground. So you probably have all of this at home and then you'll need some tape. I'm going to hold it all together with the tape. The reason why I think this will work, my hypothesis my hypothesis is that instead of um, all the pressure hitting the egg in one spot when it falls to the ground, I'm going to spread the pressure out by having this cushion around the egg. So I can still hear my egg moving around. I don't know. Do you think it will work? Once you get to this point, you can have a grown up go somewhere high or maybe um, help you in your backyard to drop the egg to test it. test it. Oh, I still hear it. I think my egg is fine. <gasps> no cracks. Okay, that was just one test. I also want to cut open a bottle, try to add some cushion in the bottle. I want to try it in a bag. So you have three ways you can, at least, that you can test your egg and have a grown-up help you. And let me know how your egg drop experiment went. Did you protect the egg well enough? Bye, I miss you, and I can't wait to see you again.